write this down, both of you, Jesse, you too. I know I can't see you, but you still have to write this down and use it in both of your podcasts, Jesse, even the one with your matrimonious uh, marriage or I, whatever the other double M was. Yeah. Use it there. You think about hook story offer, write down just that, that formula of hook story offer. I want both of you to use it every time you do a Facebook post. Um, Devin, you know, my Facebook posts are generally pretty good, right? Yeah. Yep. I use hook story offer. I use the hook story offer formula. The hook is to grab attention and get somebody excited. The story is just telling them whatever you want them to know. And the offer is having them have some type of call to action at the end. So I, I might say something like this. There's a few people out there that say you can't make money podcasting. To them, I say, I uh, just paid off a couple of rentals with money that I made solely from podcasting. And then I go into the story. That's the hook. That's to grab their attention. That's to get them to keep reading. And then I give the story and I say something like, um, I've been podcasting for six, seven or eight years, five, six, seven. I don't remember. Jesse's making fun of me, I'm sure already. <laughs> I've been podcasting for a certain amount of time and I didn't always know how to uh, make money through podcasting. But after some trial and error, I was able to pay off these couple of rentals with money that I'd made just from podcasting, which is really remarkable. I'm excited. And I just want to offer to help other people for free. All I want to do is coach you so that you can make money with your podcast. That's the story. And then the offer is, if you're interested in free coaching, just comment below and I'll, uh, I'll add you to the list so that we can give you a free coaching call. So hook story offer. Now, when we talk about hook story offer for your podcast, it's, it's not low energy. Hey, what's up guys? How are you? How, how, how was your week, man? It's good to see you. What do you got going on? This is like potentially the story, potentially, but there's no hook and it, you can't go story hook offer. There's no reason to go story and then hook and then offer. There's no reason to go offer and then story and then hook or offer and then hook and then story. It has to be hook story offer. And what yeah. that means to you guys is every Facebook post, every podcast episode, every email that you write, grab the attention of the person that you want to help. So you think to yourself, who's our perfect avatar on uh, mogul mentality? Who's the perfect avatar? What do they do? What are they going through? How old are they? Do they have kids? What, uh, what did they have for breakfast today? Where do they live in this world? What, uh, what keeps them up at night? Uh, what are they trying to achieve? What's holding them back from achieving that? This is you basically knowing everything about your avatar. Once you know those things, then now you got to call them out. Your hook on the podcast is, what's up, guys? If you are an entrepreneur and you want to be able to save more money so that you have a higher NOI in your business. So you're basically uh, making more from, from making more profits from the little bit that you've put uh, aside. This episode's really going to help you out. I, I, I think that we're going to give you three tips to making sure that not only can you grow your top line revenue, but most importantly, lower your expenses so that you can start making cash flow. Let's dive in. That's your hook. That's you giving a big promise to your listener. 